In Latin America and in Mexico, some of the consequences of the implementation of punity drug policies are mainly the rising levels of incarceration, particularly of women, and also arbitrary detention of people who use drugs in compulsory drug treatment centers. Through the life stories of women in prison or prison in drug treatment centers, we see how women go through multiple experiences of violence since childhood and throughout their lives. Violence that is basically gender-based, that is usually overlooked and not addressed or repaired by state institutions. And these women become visible in a certain way only when they're actually criminalized for a drug offense. So the idea is to show how Violence against women is one of the triggering factors behind women's involvement in drug offenses, but that is not usually taken into account by the implementation of current drug policies in Mexico, or it can even be made worse by how drug policies are implemented. I would say that some of the main challenges is to have drug policies being implemented with a gender and a human rights perspective and to make sure that um, discourses and practices criminalizing or stigmatizing uh, drug users and people who are responsible for minor non-violent drug offenses, especially women, are not put behind bars. Mm -hmm.